still no gas prop for 40 seconds. Liquid doing severe damage to the newbie home. They'll rotate towards the bottom. The tier three towers, that was the prep work for Liquid. Now they follow through. A nice bar is strike on the two. They need more play force, they need more defense, but Miracle doesn't give two hoots. Just keeps beating through the buildings. Fortifications there to protect the range racks and buy time for Death Prophet to come back alive again. When she's up, she still won't have exorcism. It'll be on cooldown for another 38 seconds. Miracle, a quick pushback. That's the Hurricane Pike going to work. A Tumberman sticking with it. Team Liquid, they're gonna make the play for Megas. Death Prophet, five seconds until she's up. The Hawks off, lost the Gale into the Necro. Mass left was, they've got really good range for that Agnum's upgrade, so they can defend inside the base. Liquid can also wait this out. The Shackles, it holds Miracle. They just keep chaining him across the universe. They hold him. Kaka wants to come out for more, but be careful. GH has Blink Echo Slam up and running. Healing Ward in the back. Liquid are so close. Just one more good fight. They know there can be buybacks on Yubi's lineup. They must have done so much economical damage that any big kill... They see everything. Here comes the Echo Slam. Is it going to be enough or not yet? The Fissure is out. Necro Control. It's a nice oldie from Moogie. Maybe the regeneration is enough. Miracle. The Agency model will pop Faith. Able to shackle him forever. Holding him. Up they come once more. No Hex. No Vincent Son of Babel. Only Slash on top of Moogie. The Shrines are doing enough. But it is all the Miracle Joe. Double kill for him. Control the back lines, the exorcism, it needs to do some damage, but right now, Newbie dropping like flies, and GG is done! Liquid will be the first team in the history of the international to whitewash the grand final. 3-0 victory over Newbie. They have been absolutely fantastic over the last few days. Liquid, they were, they were so close to elimination like two or three times in a row. And every single time they overcame it, and today they just look like just flat out the best team in the world. This series, it's not only a 3-0, there was pretty convincing wins for the most part. Just a clearly better team. Big congratulations. You thought the run could have been over. They were knocked down in the quarterfinals by Invictus Gaming. They did the hard road all the way through the lower bracket. They fought all the way up into the grand final. Taking out in the lower bracket final, LFY at the start of today. A team which everyone thought their play in the group stage was beyond contest. They kept fighting. Then up against Nubi. A 3-0 victory. Style from all round. Team Liquid. We thought they could claim the Aegis of the champions. And they're about to do exactly that. Your champions of the International 2017 is Team Liquid. Liquid are no longer doing it. Liquid have done it. Your 2017 international champions are Team Liquid. Kuroki, I'm gonna find you. Congratulations. Kuroki, every TI, every international, seven of them. This one is yours. How does it feel? Uh, feels good. I'm planning to come here again next year and stay here again. Defend your title. Yeah. I know it's a lot to process. I'm going to let you do just that. Matu, how heavy is that Aegis? Uh, yeah, you know, it, feel, it actually feels pretty good. I, I'm, a, I'm totally suspicious. Uh, uh, wow.
Wow. Hey, GH. It wasn't that long ago you were running around on pub servers. Your first TI, and you lift the trophy. Make it up for GH. How does it feel, dude? How does it feel? You are a TI champion. You are one of the best five players to play Dota 2 at this moment. Well, let me tell you something. The feeling is surreal. I just couldn't uh, accept it at first. I still can't, uh, I can't accept it right now. <laughs> I need some time. Why don't we remind them, guys? <laughs> Team Liquid, 2017 international champions. You guys are going to go and party. You have got the best night ahead of you. You've had the best day. Um, I'll let the audience say the rest. It's never been done before. 3-0. Three 3-0 zero. Three zero grand finals. Team Liquid, your champions. One more time, raise the roof of the Key Arena. Team Liquid. Team Liquid had an unbelievable path to the finals, beating Secret, Empire, Virtus Pro, LGD, LFY, and now in the finals, 3-0 against Newbie. Just remarkable. Amazing run. Really unstoppable. Best team in the world. It's crazy to think that going into the finals, they came from lowers, and yet they so clearly were the dominant team in drafting and execution when they were behind. They were able to pull back when they had a good opening. They were able to close it out. Their run this, their run this year kind of reminded me of their run this tournament. They struggled a lot at TI6, and they were pretty good before that. And they were at the bottom. They didn't even qualify for the next major, and slowly and steadily they've been building back up. And finally, this is their pinnacle. This is what Kuro has been putting tens of thousands of hours into. Gosh, seven TIs of waiting, and finally, the Aegis. I mean, what a turnaround in the middle of that game, that fight. I mean, if, if Miracle was just a little bit lower on health. That uh, DD Rune as well, like he was too yeah. uh, shouting in the center, I think, like killing him with two crits. And uh, he's like super fast as well to use his diffuser blade when the opponents use the duels. Even, even if they didn't win that game, they would have won the next one. Liquid is by far the best team here, and Kroki is such an impressive captain. All these new guys, very, very young. GH's first TI ever, first place. It's <laughs> I can't. I, I can't even imagine what those guys are feeling. It's just incredible to think Woo! how versatile their hero lineup was. You could see in every single game how much practice was there. GH, uh, he hasn't lost a game with Earthshaker <laughs> in ages, as far as it feels. And I mean, we didn't even see his wisp today. <laughs> Who do you ban against them? It doesn't matter. Team Liquid always seemed to have an answer, uh, except for how to open this champagne bottle. That's going to be a real challenge.
This is going to be fun to see. <laughs> Champagne bottles are always a tricky thing in esports. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, why, why don't they just give him like you know sparkling water something with a screw off cap let's see let's see if team liquid can be the first team in all of esports to successfully open the champagne he can't open it they can win 3-0 in the grand finals but they can't open a champagne bottle there we go. <laughs> He, he just holds it as it spills on his hand. Yeah, right from the bottle. There it is. <laughs> I mean, how do you do it? I'm not going to do this. I can't do it. You should do it. MC! No, no. Can you twist this for me? Well, as the players have demonstrated, they're the best Dota team in the world. But, you know, it's... You, you gotta understand those caps on those champagne bottles. I mean, how could they have prepared for this? It's tough. I know. I know. You know, PPD. I know you've won a TI. Talk to me about the technique of opening the champagne. You don't need to open your own champagne anymore. You can afford someone else to do it for you. Because you're gonna get drunk tonight. Yeah, karaoke's gonna celebrate, man. No, no, I'm fine. As they should. It's been a long year. <laughs> Hasn't been easy. Liquid has not been the best team all year. They just happen to be the best team at this time. How long does it take to set in? Uh, I mean, I don't know. This this moment will change their lives forever, and they'll never forget it. So, I think a day, like until you actually like understand what you have done and that you actually want TI and can start to comprehend what the, what actually happened. Yeah, I mean, your body, your mind has been completely focused, programmed. They're like, oh, God, not more soda. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> Look, we're not going to give you any prize money unless you can each open a champagne bottle successfully. Pretty sure they're going to play Dota tomorrow. Yeah. As is everybody else here. Yeah, I mean, one of the greatest treats about the end of TI is that you get to go home and play Dota. It is, like, the most exciting moment because you have all the ideas, all the strategies in your head. You saw the pros do them. Yep. TI may have come to an end, but tomorrow is the start of the new season. Ooh. It's going to be a big one for Dota this year. I'm, I'm very optimistic about what's future for Dota holds. Gosh, Team Liquid as an organization has so many championships. Now they get to also say they have a Dota 2 TI win under their belts. Just incredible. They picked a good captain. Yeah. Broke you know, he's been here for seven years. He's yet to take home the Aegis. He's finally got a roster that he believes in. His team believes in him. And they managed to make it work. And again, there's no TI winner twice, right? Yeah, no TI winner twice. Yeah. So Next year, PPD. Kuroki. Oh, yeah. All Sorry right. Little Dota anecdotes. First pick, Viper. Hey, Second pick, Jungle Bloodseeker. <laughs> I'm out. You're the boss, man. You, you I'm out. <laughs> out. Dude, it's hard to even think of a weak link in the lineup. Every single player. Uh, to have them coming out of the elevator now, the doors are about to open. And when they do, we don't know how slow this elevator is, but we're going to find out. What's going to be really cool is there are fans already lining up on the red carpet outside. So this will be really their first chance to be up close and personal with their fans, to thank them in person. And we're wondering how much it's all really been sinking in. Here they are. Coming out, coming out. All right, guys. How's it going? Uh, that nice. Look at all your fans. Yeah. What do you want to say to all of them right now? Uh, oh, oh, that's a sec. Oh, all right. <laughs> We're going to kill you first, and then we'll... <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the support. I appreciate you coming here and stuff. Yeah. No, that's. Oh, you were telling him what to say, but actually that was perfect. Say. No, no, no. Yeah. Fine, fine. Yeah. Uh, I just want to say thanks to all the fans and the family friends who believed in us. Of course, we appreciate it. Uh, I just want to say that thanks for believing in us throughout all this journey. We had some rough patches, but we're we're here now, so I'm pretty happy about it. And now you're very deserving of the red carpet. So I'm gonna let you come out this way. I'm gonna follow you because I should never walk in front of champions. No, no, no. No, no, but after you, sir. Okay, he's insisting that I would. <laughs> At least I'm behind Kuro. That makes me feel a little bit better. All right, guys, here you go. Your TI champions, guys, right here. Come on, give them some love. Here they are. What, what are you thinking right now? I mean, has it all had a chance to sink in now that you're seeing all this? Uh, I'm not. I just can't realize that we 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 won the final. I know. 
Yeah. Is that crazy? Yeah. And by the way, in, in, in a good fashion. What about you? Is it sinking in? Slowly. Well, you know, being number one feels goddamn great. You want to talk to some of your fans over here? This guy looks nice. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> Can you please, please hold it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. On my hand. Did you say hold my hand or on? On my hand. Okay, good. Dude, this guy. This is guy. This man. guy. He's the man. Right? Oh my God. Ti winner. Ten million dollars. Holy hell. Hold it yourself. Million U.S. dollars. <laughs> Catch up with your. I, I'm slowing you down. <laughs> All right, here we go. We're running. How do you even have the energy now, man? I mean, it was a quick. Oh, it was a quick one. Did you expect right, it to be that quick? The camera now. Uh, no, I thought the newbies actually uh, the give us a so lot more <laughs> effort beating them. But uh, I don't know. It's just I, I'm so focused in Dota that I don't know what to say. I, I just focus on the games, and now it feels kind of empty inside. Actually, yeah. just like the games ended, and like I have no purpose anymore. What's next, right? Yeah, I mean, what's next? It's like I was so happy playing these games, but like, now there's like. I don't know. Well, now you have to defend your title. I mean, next year, yeah, but uh, in the moment, I feel Come back next year. Uh, oh, <laughs> empty hands. What can I say? I know. Well, you guys have earned this. I hope you guys get a chance to let it sink in. Take a look. Oh, look at all these fans. Get in there with your teammates. You're the champion. You're the best. Yeah, sure. Thank you very much. We've been playing really well. Pleasure. All case in there. Hey, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> They're being surrounded by fans. They deserve it. They're finally getting exactly what they came here for. I can't even imagine. You guys, we got to get you into your limo. Yeah, I got to tell you, there are a lot of vehicles out here. <laughs> Let's see if we can find you your limo. <laughs> toot, toot, toot. You guys, can we get one more round of applause for your TI champs? What's next? What are you going to do tonight to celebrate? Uh, I don't know. We're very tired. Long day. I told you I'd give you enough time to prep for the last series. Yeah, thank you. Uh, As you left, I thought, if they lose, it's going to be on me. I don't know. I, we, we had enough time. I think they gave us some more time, so that was nice. Congratulations to all of you guys. Your thank TI you champs. Congratulations, you guys. They have to go party it up now.